Last year, I wrote an article about how to create a reading indicator with CSS only. It worked okay, but it had many shortfalls, like the code was a bit hacky, and also it didn't work when the page had a background image, which is something relatively common. Since then, CSS has evolved and released new features, and one of them is the scroll-driven animations. With them, we are able to create a reading indicator in a really easy and clean way. I have preloaded this page with some Lauren Ipsum text that is going to make it uh, scrollable. And I'm going to add a reading indicator using scroll-driven animations. You're going to see how easy and clean it is. First, I'm going to create the reading indicator on HTML. So I'm going to put a div, I'm going to put a class reading indicator, and I'm going to close it. Now, I'm going to come here and say the reading indicator is going to have a position of fixed. It's going to be top zero and left zero. So it's in the top left corner. By default, it's going to have a width of zero and a height of, let's say, one rem. Finally, so it's visible, we're going to add a background of blue. Right now, the reading indicator is not visible even if I scroll that's because it has a width of zero. And this is nice because this is the behavior that browsers that don't support scroll driven animations is going to show. Basically, they're going to gracefully fail and not show the indicator. So now what we want to do is as we scroll, we're going to make it grow. So first of all, we're going to add the animation keyframes, grow reading and say two with 100%. So it goes to 100% of the width of the page. And now what we're going to say is the animation is going to be the grow reading and it's going to happen linear. With this, still we don't have anything, but here's where the magic happens. We're going to say animation timeline is going to be a scroll with the root. And with this, what we're telling is, as we scroll the root, apply the animation grow reading. So you see now, if I start scrolling, I need to save here. And when I start scrolling, you can see the bar is growing here. And if I scroll up, it goes away. That's because it's applying the animation as we scroll. Now we can make it look like a nice scroll bar like let's make it thicker and save we can make it so instead of being blue we add a linear gradient linear gradient and let's say 45 degrees from uh, reddish to a bluish and you see now i save and you see it looks nicer and just with that with 14 lines of code we have a reading indicator in CSS only.